What's up guys? Ben with the Hookup Tackle. Hope you're having a wonderful weekend. Today we are going to break down, discuss new items that arrived in this week as well as important restocks so that you can stay informed and hopefully catch more fish. So if you're ready, let's go. All right, so new items this week. If you don't follow us already on Instagram, we would love for you to follow us at the Hookup Tackle underscore USA. Of course, you can follow me personally as well at the Tackle Otaku. You could follow Jeffrey at what's Jeff's thing again? You can follow Jeffrey at Jeffrey the King. One of these days I'm going to remember that. Okay, so new products. First and foremost, the one that a lot of guys have been super stoked about getting ever since they released this at the Osaka show earlier this year. This is new from Mega Bass. This is the SV3 spinnerbait. Now the SV3 spinnerbait is going to be available in four sizes, 3 8 half, 5 8 and 3 quarter. It's available in two different blade combinations. This is the double willow combination here. It is also available in what they're calling a slow roll, which is basically a tandem willow, Colorado on the front and a willow on the back. Some things about the SV3, first of all, is this is a remake of one of their most famous spinnerbaits that's been in their lineup for a long time. They basically gutted it and remade it top to bottom so that they could develop really the ultimate everyday use spinnerbait. Special designed SV3 SV blades are easy to spin. They're a special combination of both flash and vibration. It is a very heavy gauge wire, so it's gonna be very durable, but it also still flexes, so it's gonna give incredible pulsation. The skirt is designed to pulse with the blade. So just like the Jamaica Boa, if you've seen any underwater action where that blade pulses and the skirt pulses with it, you're gonna get the same underwater action with this. So the skirt and the blades are gonna work in tandem to pulsate together. The head is a special design, what they're calling a drop and delta balancing head. So you notice it's got a little bit of a unique shape to it. And the idea is, is that you can fish this thing fast and quick, but it will still maintain its depth. So unlike most spinnerbaits that you can let sink wherever you want, but then as soon as you start winding them in, they come up to the top. This guy is gonna keep its depth so you can fish quickly and fast along the bottom or in some deeper zones. $12.99, which is a great price point for Mega Bass. It's available in 10 colors in each blade combination in each size. So they're gonna go quick. So definitely snatch those up while you can. All right, a big restock uh, in new bait week from Depths Japan. And really, mostly restock, but some really important key items. So if you guys enjoy smaller glide baits, a couple new releases this week from Depths Japan. There is the Tiny Bull Shooter which has been long anticipated. They did a very small little teaser drop of this a few months ago. This is the first legitimate drop that they've had on this guy. It's 100 millimeters long, it's one ounce, it glides very easy. Really more of, I would say, more of a jerk side to side, wouldn't you say, Jeff? Yeah. More than like a true glide. But it's a perfect small snack size bluegill imitation. It's available in several colors. They're selling out very quick, and this is gonna be the last drop of these until the new year. So if you guys are fishing around anything that looks like a bluegill, this is a great thing to add. Also, the Slide Swimmer 115 came out, which is the smallest version of the Slide Swimmer, which is really gonna have more of a true glide to it. So again, if you guys are looking for smaller, more compact glide baits that are easy to throw on really any gear, these are available from Depths. Also restocking from Depths, is our favorite chatterbait trailer, the Death Hatter. So the five inch has been out of stock for some time in some of the key colors like green pumpkin and white ice and chartreuse laser. These are all back in stock now, so definitely grab those quick. Basically what the Death Hatter does that other trailers like a Kitek or a Zaka or something don't do is Death Hatter just tightens it up. So if you guys are throwing jackhammers or whatever chatterbait you guys are throwing, they are basically designed to have a real wide action. The Death Hatter is gonna just tighten it up a little bit. So it's like going from a round fat wobbling crankbait to like a flat side crankbait where it just tightens it. So definitely gives it a different look. So give those a shot. All right, new for us from Depths is a couple of deeper diving crankbaits. This is the DC300 Kickbacker and the DC400 Cascabel. These are gonna be their deeper diving crankbaits. This dude's gonna get into that three to three and a half meter range. This dude's gonna get in that four to four and a half meter range. So you're covered in that 10 to 14 foot zone. Lots of noise, 
Lots of sound, a specially designed lip. They have amazing side-to-side -side action to them. So if you're looking for just a different option for that 10 to 15 foot range on you know, 14, 16 pound line, the DC series crankbaits are a great one. All right, new from Depths Japan is the Huge Buzzbait Type 2. Now, the original version of the Huge Buzzbait was one of our best-selling buzzbaits. It's a very big profile buzzbait. They call this the Monster Hunting Spec. It's a big blade, big head. This dude is really loud. So it's got not just a clacker that the blade's gonna hit, but it also has a ball on the wire. So it's gonna hit two different clacks to have a lot of heavy sound and two different vibrations going on. The Huge Buzz Bay 2 is a closed eye. So it's gonna be very, very durable. So if you guys are throwing this on braid or you're fishing for you know big large mouth, pike, musky, any predator that's really gonna tear shit up, this is a great option for you. So available in a bunch of colors, it's a half ounce size, huge buzz bait type two. All right, and then another important restock to note from Depths Japan is the return of the smaller sizes in the spiny crawl. So spiny crawl is available in a three and a half, a four, and a four eight size. Three and a half is the most popular size for a jig trailer, Ned Rig, smaller finesse presentations, sell out very quickly every time we get these guys in. So if you guys have been waiting for these, all the good colors are back. Blue Marin, Green Pumpkin Orange, Green Pumpkin. So definitely check those dudes out. All right, an important restock from OSP Japan, the return of the Blitz Magnum MR. Now the Blitz Magnum MR is the largest crankbait in the OSP lineup. You're looking at a true one ounce crankbait here. This dude is capable of about four and a half meters of dive depth on 16 pound line. So they know it's a big crankbait, they know you're gonna be throwing heavy line, but it still gets down into that 12 to 14 foot zone. So if you guys are looking for a big bodied crankbait that performs flawlessly, and the reason OSP crankbaits are so good at diving and just working right out of the gate is all the OSP baits feature a special honeycomb skeleton construction, something that they've patented, that they've designed. And what that does is it allows the bait to have the same strength as a traditional ABS plastic, but it weighs much less. So it's just gonna perform effortlessly, it vibrates hard, it swims great. These dudes have a little bit of a deep rattling sound vibration in them, so they're gonna give you a little bit of sound, a lot of body, it's just a great option when you want something a little bit bigger, the Blitz Magnum MR. In new this week from Lucky Craft is a couple of really cool little trout baits. These are the Areas spinner baits. So if you guys fish a lot of trout, they're really designed for trout, but a lot of guys are using these in ponds and smaller waters for bass as well. It's uh, basically just a very simple spinner bait, a single blade. Uh, it's a special design blade for Lucky Craft, are made in Japan. These are the feathered treble version. So you're gonna have a little bit of that feathered treble to give some life. You're gonna have that blade spinning and the blade propels beautifully on the pause as well. So you can swim it straight, you can give it a pause and just let that blade flutter and it's really gonna catch a lot of fish. These are 3.5 grams. So it's gonna be about an eighth of an ounce. This is definitely spinning rod territory, but if you want a spinner bait and still maintain that small size, the areas is a great option. All right, in new from Geek Crack Japan is the new Bellows Craw. The Bellows Craw is the latest addition to their Bellows series of stick and gill. Features that same kind of ribbed body and ribbed claw effect on there. So a lot of guys have really been enjoying the Geek Crack. So this is just one more thing to add to the lineup. Available in a bunch of colors, $8.49 a bag, available now. All right, back in stock from Evergreen Japan is a promotion that we did several months ago and we sold out instantly. This is the Evergreen Brim Slide Glide Bait with the custom box promotion. So the Brim Slide is one of the most beautiful bluegill profile swim baits from Japan. Normal retails for $69.99. Well, Evergreen made a custom box to go with it and it is on promo for $49.99. The Brim Slide box is a foam box that perfectly fits your Brim Slide, your hooks, your accessories. So everything fits in there perfect. It's got a foam piece on the top, so it stores your bait, keeps it perfectly straight, all your fins, everything, the embroidered logo on the side. Just a really cool deal from Evergreen Japan. So $49.99, you get the bait and the box. All right, in new for us this week are Bait Sanity products, both the Antidote Glide 
and the Explorer Glide. Bait Sanity is known for making good quality glide baits at a very inexpensive price. This is a $29.99 bait and Jeff is laughing his ass off. They take shit very serious there. Okay, they wear their mask, they wear their gloves. So it's, I mean, it's on the package. So it's gotta be real. But anyways, if you're looking for a seven inch glide bait that weighs just about two and a half to three ounces, 29 bucks. It's a great way if you're looking to get into glide baits, a good starter platform, Bay Sandy are available now. In new from Daiwa, the highly anticipated release of yet another Tatula. Here is the Tatula CT100. This is the new CT. Not sure why we need yet another Tatula, but here is one, okay? It is more of a compact frame, smaller handle. It's kind of a blue. It's really smooth, 129 bucks. So I mean, price point, I get it. So one more Tatula to confuse it, but if you guys have been waiting on it, it is available now. Six to one, seven to one, and eight to one gear ratio. A good restocking from Daiwa is the return of one of our favorite spinning reels is the Kage LT. So it is available in a 1000, a 2000, and a 2500 series. This is a beautiful reel. This is a pro shop only reel, so you're not gonna find this online. Uh, so you're gonna need to either come into our store or give us a call and uh, we can help you. Okay, the Kage is a matte black. It is a nine plus one bearing system, so it is butter smooth, super smooth. I mean, this thing feels like a $400 reel for $199, okay? The drag is butter smooth, comes with a cork grip. It's a great deal, guys, for 199 bucks. So if you have any interest, come in, check them out, give us a call, we can definitely help you. That's new from Daiwa. All right, that is the breakdown of what was new here this week. Thank you guys for watching. As always, thank you for the support. Thank you for your business. A lot of these baits are so good at catching fish, even Hippie could catch one <laughs> on some of these. What do you think, Hippie? I don't know, is it true? Let's find out. Probably not. <laughs> All right, as always, thank you guys. Peace out. Arigatou gozaimasu. Goodbye.